Our story starts in downtown Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin. Located on the shores of Lake Michigan, Sturgeon Bay marks the eastern terminus of the Ice Age National Scenic Trail. So we're right in downtown Sturgeon Bay, and this sidewalk here is the Ice Age National Scenic Trail. Uh, can you believe that? It goes right through downtown Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin. Um, just uh, over there across the bay is a Potawatomi State Park where it starts. I've talked about that in a previous video. And right there is the woolly mammoth. I bet you this, this beast feels at home today. <laughs> The Ice Age Trail cuts a long swath, 1,200 miles through the state. And while these spots are joined by the common thread of the trail, their geology and scenery are wildly different. It all ends here, or starts for that matter, on the west side of the state. Interstate State Park in St. Croix Falls is as different from Potawatomi as it is the same. Northern Wisconsin greets us with pristine lakes, boreal forests, waterfalls, and beauty without compare. But again, the glaciers left their mark on the landscape. 13 to 26,000 years ago, glaciers came through the area, and as they receded, uh, they left a lot of sediments, deposits, till, and things like that. And we end up with lakes, lots of lakes, lots and lots of lakes um, <laughs> uh, from, the, uh, from, the, from the glaciation. From the Northwoods, we head south to the Driftless area. Untouched by the glaciers, this region in southwest Wisconsin features Precambrian sandstone with bluffs and deep valleys carved by eons of erosion. not done exploring, join us as we dig deeper into the majestic beauty of the place we call Wisconsin. Mm -hmm. 